Right, heavyweight boxing legend Mike Tyson is the focus of a new limited series on Hulu called Mike. Our next guest, Russell Hornsby, plays boxing promoter Don King, one of the central figures in the saga of Iron Mike. But they will pay for a show. Top dollar. So they'll pay to see Jordan drop a triple double or Michael Moon walk or you dominate in the ring. Because as long as they're watching that, as long as they see a few of you with money and freedom, they don't have to think about the ones that don't. And it makes them feel good when they go to sleep at night. Ah. <laughs> yeah. Good. Pretty good. Yeah, yeah. Russell Hornsby joining us now. Welcome. Thank you. You know, uh, Don King, right? One of the most uh, iconic, uh, one of the greatest promoters, if not the greatest promoter of all time. And you see there, when you have that hair, uh, who can forget him as, as a figure? How do, how do you get, uh, what was the most challenging part of preparing for that role? Honestly, um, the most challenging part of preparing for the role was the lack of uh, time to prepare. Uh, <laughs> when I uh, got the job, I had about 10 days from the day I got the job uh, till I had to be on set for my wow. first scene. Oh my gosh. Wow. That's cramming for the test. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I did a lot of that in college, so, <laughs> you know. <laughs> uh, have you actually ever met him in person? No, I had never had the, uh, the opportunity to meet him or to talk with him, but, um, you know, I, I just wanted to do him and the character and uh, Don Justice and just bring out the humanity in Don. Okay. as well as show the, the showmanship. Well, obviously, this is, uh, we said Lemon Series. I believe it has, it's eight parts, and it focuses on the life of, of Mike Tyson. Uh, are there any big surprises that we're going to take away from this program? Well, I mean, I, I think the biggest surprise is, is just really seeing the intimate uh, relationship that uh, Don had with Mike and that also that Mike had with... Uh, his uh, boxing promoter, Customato, and the relationships that he developed, you know, and he had with, obviously, with Robin and, and so on. Um, I think we just kind of go a little bit more in depth and uh, put a magnifying glass on his whole life. Yeah, it's almost for, for a very large part of the career of, of, of Mike Tyson, Don King was just uh, indelible in, in all of that, right? Because you had Mike who was kind of like, you know, in many ways, a little quieter of a figure. And then you had Don King who was so masterful in, 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 in promoting him, right? Did you, did you watch a couple of like some old videos of, of Don King to try and get that, that uh, swagger that he had? Yes, you know, of course. I mean, I think when we look at Don King when he began working with Ali, when we were talking about the thrill in Manila or the rumble in the jungle, and at that time, Muhammad Ali was the one with the personality who sold right. the show or who sold the fight. And I think that when he got to the point when he was working with Mike, as you stated, more of a quiet, subdued individual, Don realized that he had to be the show in order to sell the fights. And so he understood that, you know, when you're being a boxing promoter, it is about the show and it is about giving people what they want. And I think what he chose to do was turn it up a notch. And uh, he had learned a lot from Muhammad Ali, I think, as well. Mm. Well, we have less than a minute, uh, Russell, but we want to give you a chance to respond because uh, Mr. Mike Tyson himself, he has been vocal about this and criticized the series because he wasn't a part of developing it. Uh, and you had quite a response to that. Well, I mean, yeah, I mean, I think that, you know, uh, Mike has a right to feel the way he feels. Uh, he has a right to, you know, not care for the series. Um, but at the same time, we all know that um, all of this information is a part of the public domain. And that being so, you know, uh, a lot of people are open to use it. The same thing that happened with the Lakers uh, series winning time. Uh, all of that information about Jerry Buss and Magic Johnson is all in the public domain. And those folks at HBO decided to use that material and create a show af out of it. And that's what Hulu did, did the same thing. Well, we do like what you normally do with all your characters. We're looking forward to seeing uh, your portrayal here of, of Don King. You, as you said, you bring a lot of humanity to uh, your characters there, as well as your, your character that you play on Black Mafia Family. We enjoy that as well. So, uh, Russell Hornsby, always great to see you. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. Mike is streaming on Hulu right now. I can't wait to check it out. Yeah. Yeah. All right.